Hi, I am going to discuss about the two input NOR gate design using NMOS technology. Or else they may ask the question like this y is equal to a plus p. So for design for the circuit for the given logic. So we know that uh, the NOR gate symbol and uh, two input NOR gate symbol having two inputs A and B. This is A and this is B. Y is equal. NOR gate output is A plus B whole power. So this is only the symbol, but internal circuit we need to design. So how to design a circuit? What are the rules? So I will explain here. Before that, we should know about the truth table. So 0 plus 0, 0, bar means 1. 0 plus 1, 1, bar means 0. So like this, so 1 plus 1, 1, bar means 0. So this is the symbol. Internal circuit we need to design. Uh, this is uh, the final circuit. How to draw this? I will explain. To input NAND gate circuit. So, what are the rules? I will explain using NMOS technology. We know that the NOR gate output A plus B whole bar. According to design rules, uh, if plus is there, the pull down network should be parallel. Pull down network should be parallel. So this is the input A and this is the input B. This is the input A and this is the input B. So this is ground. And pull up network, anyhow, we need to use one more circuit uh, that is NMOS. I'll tell you. So if it is addition, so the rule is uh, pull down network uh, should be in parallel. If it is multiplication, the pull down network should be in series. This is the rule for that. So using that rule, I am designing here A. This is A and this is B. I am assuming. So this is B, A. This is the transistor. I am assuming this is source, gate, drain. Similarly, source, gate, drain. This is an pull down network. Of course, ground is required. We need to draw the ground using metal. And coming to the pull up, NMOS only you should use here. That is the condition because it is using NMOS technology. We need to get the output, but all should be NMOS transistors. So that's why they are going to use depletion mode transistor. This is the dark line indicates it is the depletion mode NMOS transistor. It is source gate then or else NPN transistor. NPN transistor or source gate drain. So in between pull up and pull down, we need to take the output. Depletion mode means we know that uh, it is already the channel is established between source and drain. Source and drain in depletion mode transistor. So that is the reason here. Here always it is on condition because uh, the source and gates are interconnected. Source, gate, drain, and that it is a depletion mode. It is in on condition. And this is, uh, I will check the one condition whether we are getting the output or not. 0 plus 0, A equal 0, B equal 0, is equal 0. Whole power means 1 we need to get the output. I will check it this condition. And before that, this is on condition always, and this is an NMOS transistor, source gate drain and source gate drain. So both are NMOS, of course, three are NMOS. And then I am giving zero here, A equal to zero, and B is also equal to zero. So as you discussed earlier, the NMOS transistor should be on when it is on source gate drain. So this is an NMOS and VGS voltage between gate and shore should be greater than VT. Then only it will goes to on condition. This is the first condition. So when it is uh, when uh, when it is VGS is less than or equal 
Vt, so the transistor will goes to off condition. So now we can see this, this is an NMOS means NPN and there is no sufficient VGS here, so it will goes to off condition. This will goes to off condition. This will goes to, because this is also NMOS, so it will goes to off condition. So T1 is always on, T2 is, and T3 is off condition now because there is no sufficient VGS or else you can assume like this just assumption 0 is I am assuming negative P means positive negative to positive reverse bias goes to off condition similarly this is also off condition now we can see this uh, here this pull down network is in off condition and uh, so that's the reason there is no flow of current between there is no flow of current between from here to here so now the VDD is flowing uh, like this. This is an supply VDD. Now VDD is flowing through this transistor T1 and available across the output is high. So while giving 0, 0, the output is high. One more condition I will explain. 1 plus 1 equal to 1 bar means we need to get 0. This is the second case I am assuming. Now I am assuming, I am assuming V equal to 1, B equal to 1. So, A equal to 1 I am assuming, B equal to 1 I am assuming. So, when you are giving 1, so there is a sufficient VDS, it will goes to sufficient VGS, it will goes to on condition. And mass transistor will goes to on condition. Or else you can assume like this, 1 is positive, P means positive. Both are positive, forward bias goes to on condition. So, this is on and this is also goes to on condition. This is on and this is on. T2 is on, T3 is on and T1 is also always on condition here. So now the VTD is flowing through this direction from here to here or either this direction or else this direction totally it is grounded through T1 and T2 and T3. So now there is no output, uh, output available across this hence the output is 0. So condition 2 also satisfied. So like that we can uh, get the remaining two output cases also. So this is named as pull up transistor and this is named as pull down transistor. You can see this always the pull up transistor try to get the output as high. The pull down transistor try to get the output as low. So like this we can design and all our three and three transistors are NMOS only that's why it is named as NMOS uh, trans, using NMOS we, we are designed to input NAR gate. So the same you can see this A plus B whole bar like this we can design any n number of transistors uh, number of logic gates. So here uh, A plus B whole bar only so if it is A plus B plus C whole bar is there also we can go with three transistor A parallel if it is addition as I said it is parallel A, B and C. Three transistors are in parallel. So now this is the pull down network, pull down network and uh, coming to here we need to go with single, single depletion mode transistor. So like this we can design an n number of circuits. Thank you.